Hi artists, super excited you could join me. So look what we're drawing. This cute little panda bear. Um, to get ready, grab a pencil. You could also do a Sharpie. Um, any pen, any marker works and any size uh, paper. So let's get going. So artists, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have this panda bear drawing uh, to the left of me so that you kind of can see the lines that I am uh, drawing. Very first thing I'm going to actually do is I'm gonna draw the circle for my head or an oval. It does not have to be a perfect shape. Um, sometimes I even take my finger and draw something with my finger to make sure I'm not too tiny or ooh, way too big. So mm, I think this will be fine. So take your marker or your Sharpie or your pencil and let's draw a shape for the head. And remember, look at this, looks a little bit different than that one. It's fine. Um, let's do the ears. They're fairly large actually. And I'm gonna draw two curved lines. Curved line on the right side curved line on the left side and as you can tell panda bears are black white black white black white black white black everything is a pattern so we're gonna have to color quite a bit so next I'm going to draw this cute little nose and it is an oval. Um, so let's put an oval on our paper. There is a curved line to the left and a curved line to the right. Now the eye or the eye patch, there's a tiny dot circle and then I'm going to draw the eye patch. Tiny dot, circle around it, the eye patch, same on this side, tiny dot, circle, and the eye patch shape. Give them some big paws. Here's one, and here's one. Now, inside the bottom of the paws, you see another shapes, a big oval for the bottom paw. Circle, circle, circle. So, oval. Circle, 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 oval, circle, circle, circle. So I'm going to color those in. Right here, I'm going to draw a line that goes down and curves into the foot. Here, line goes down, curves right there. Then I'm going to do the same on this side. Line that goes down and curves. So now I have to do some jumping over because the paws are in the front. So I'm going to fill this right here. That's his body. Now, right here, I'm going to draw another curved line under his face and a little more coloring black. All right, so next thing that is missing is his arms and I'm gonna just draw a straight line that kind of curves into the body. So right here, straight, curves into the body, straight, 
curves into the body. Let's color that. So um, we've recreated that same pain the bear. So what I'm going to do next is I am going to add a little bit of um, background. Um, how about some grass? Just add some grass. He's sitting on it. And here I'm going to dip my grass a little bit. Here's a big one. Oop, like that. Um, bamboo. The way I like to draw bamboo is I just draw a line that goes down, over, up. Leave a gap. And then down, curve, curve. How about a couple leaves? Another bamboo, leave a gap, and how about a third one? So um, I'm going to color it. I'm going to quickly show you what I use for coloring. I use markers like this. Um, I also use colored pencils. Any um, type you have, you can also just color it um, with regular colored pencils and not mix your art medium or crayon if you have them. Um, anything works. So I'm going to speed this up and um, also please subscribe if you would like to um, see a few more videos that I'm posting. I'd be really happy about it. Thank you.